All right, how's it going? Um, I'm going to answer the age-old question of how far can you go on a rad wagon, rad power bikes, electric bike. I am not going to pedal at all. I'm just going to just use the throttle only and uh, see how far we could go. So you can see I got this thing um, a little bit decked out. Got the stereo, got the ghetto blaster here. It's pretty sweet. It's the Fenoso, Foniso. It's like a kind of a cheaper version of the Jarv Big Shot, but this thing is actually really loud. Even when I'm going full speed, this thing still just cranks it out. Uh, I got a little seat if I want to ride around a passenger like my wife or someone. Um, yeah, makes it nice and easy. And I got these. These were, I got on eBay for 25 bucks, including shipping and handling. You can see they almost come down to the, uh, to the running boards here, but they'll fit probably, I'd say, a case in each one, a case of beer if you wanted to do. You could do, show up to a party with two cases of beer. I know, who shows up to a party with only two cases of beer, right? Um... Yeah, that was that was a bad one. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna see how far I can go on just electric power, just the motor, no pedaling, real range test. Full bars, got 42 miles on the meter, and let's take off. going downhill right now. Uphill a little bit here. And this is mostly a flat terrain, so I'm just going to be doing laps on the flat terrain. Not too many hills, mostly just full throttle, full throttle the whole time. This bike is pretty fun to just kind of whip around. It's got a, it's got a little spring. It's got a little spring there for the steering, and it kind of kind of acts as like a steering dampener, kind of. But uh, yeah, it handles really well. because I think from the factory it's set to 20 miles an hour. But if you go under like the mode and the settings under this thing, you could set the top speed. I think it's set to 30 kilometers an hour. You could just you could set it up to 40 kilometers an hour. So that'll like self-govern it at 40 kilometers, which is like, I don't know, 24 miles an hour. And uh, yeah, so that's what it does. It uses a little bit more wattage, but you go a little bit faster. And I like it. All right, so it's come down to the one bar for the first time. We're at 9.6, 9.6 mi 9.7 miles. We're at one bar. Uh, but I think if I let go of the throttle now, if I just coast for a little bit, yeah, it'll go back up to two. 
So I'm not too worried about that one bar reading. So what I want to do here is I want to come to a complete stop and I am going to, let's do an acceleration test. All right, so here we go. We're stop and gunning it, I'm gunning it, not pedaling. Oh man, if I had hair, it'd be blowing back right now. Let's go zero to top speed. Oh my god, I've never gone 16 miles an hour before. Oh, pure adrenaline, I'm peeing right now. I've got so much pee going down my leg. That's, that's kind of cool. That's actually kind of cool, making turns like that. Uh, yeah, so I don't know. Zero to 20 in about 10 seconds. It's not too bad. All right, I have noticed that since one bar, top speed is now only around 18, 18 and a half. Yeah, full throttle right now. Let's see what we get up to. All right, now I got the wind. Wind's kind of at my back now. So yeah, with one bar, ooh, all right, I got just about the 20, uh, 21, 20.3, 20.4, 20.5. All right, with the wind slightly at my back, probably five to 10 mile an hour gusts, I got up to 20.5. So, at one bar, definitely power is decreased. All right, 17 miles, still at one bar, sing will not die. Oh, I think it just died. Uh, power just cut off. Uh, yeah, it's pulsing right now. I think it's starting to go to like to protect itself. I got the throttle down, but it's not doing anything, and now the battery thing is flashing. So if I kind of, yeah, it's it's like speed. I don't know that light just came on. Oop, yeah, it's like pulsing on and off right now. 17.5. Just power just cut out again. All right, so now I've just been trying to keep it like around three, 300 watts, going around 15 miles an hour. I'm up to 18.2 miles. Just doing that, I've been able to eke out quite a bit more uh, range. All right, we're at 18.8, it's starting to cut out again. It hasn't been cutting out that much as long as I've been keeping it kind of slow. All right, so I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna do a mercy kill because this thing just keeps cutting out slower and slower. And I could probably do this for about another, I don't know, half mile until it's completely dead, but I don't want to damage any batteries or anything. So, we're going to call it at 19.3. That was with me almost full throttle as much as the time. Probably 80% of it was just me full throttle. So you could probably drive it more efficiently, doing half power, keeping it under 400 watts. I'd say you could probably get this thing to go. I probably you could easily do 30 miles if you were to do 15 miles an hour and just kind of save the battery, save the motor, easily get 30 miles if you're not in a hurry. But uh, yeah, I was able to get about 19 and a half miles, uh, kind of hammering on it and uh, riding into the wind, going up and down hills, not too big of hills and not that hard of wind. It's about 64 degrees out right now. So this is kind of like optimum temperature for doing this experiment. So, all right, later guys.